God, it's Friday. You're welcome to another edition of the BNFT Digest. I'm Lily for Obaba Utu. The Coalition of Savannah Accelerated Development Authority Zone Civil Society Organizations has reminded the government to reaffirm its commitment to the SADA Master Plan. Mr. Bismarck Adongo Oyorogo, the Executive Secretary, in a statement copied to the Ghana News Agency in Accra, said that the civil society had developed a comprehensive development blueprint called SADA Master Plan to guide the transformational agenda of the Northern Savannah Ecological Zone. And the local pharmaceutical manufacturers have expressed worry over outstanding debts owed drug supplies by the National Health Insurance Scheme, saying the situation is hampering business operations. In an interview with the BNFT, the managing director of Danex Limited, Yao Oparia Samwa, indicated that the situation stands at the greatest challenge facing drug supply and needs to be addressed within the earliest possible time or cash and carry would come back. And in our final story, Minister-designate for Business Development, Awal Ibrahim Mohammed, has indicated that government will roll out a long-term strategy that will help boost the private sector, especially small and medium-scale enterprises, in a bid to accelerate growth. His mandate includes initiating policies and measures to achieve the best competitive stand for Ghanaian enterprises, as well as attracting investment to key sectors of the economy and coordinating activities of the Ghana Investment Promotion Council, National Board for Small Scale Industries and Microfinance and Small Loans Centre. And that's it for the top business stories making headlines. Do grab a copy of the BNFT newspaper or simply visit our website, thebftonline.com, for more stories. My makeup is by Juven House of Beauty. The BNFT Digest is sponsored by Belacqua Natural Mineral Water. Have a nice day.